In keeping with our bold hue, long-term test car obsession, the crew at Kelly Blue Book has added this insane copper Chrysler Pacifica Limited trim to our fleet. And just to keep things interesting, we went with the hybrid uh, in there. Naturally, a big focus of our year-long test will be the Pacifica's electrified powertrain, regenerative brakes, and general efficiency. As a reminder, the Pacifica isn't merely a hybrid, it's a plug-in hybrid. Use that plug, and the EPA says we should be able to cover 33 gas-free miles. As Reagan once said, trust but verify. Though I'm pretty sure he wasn't talking about hybrid minivans. It'll also be interesting to see if we can match the EPA's 32 mpg combined fuel economy rate. Assuming so, that could have big implications for overall ownership costs, as will a $7,500 federal tax credit that essentially nullifies the hybrid's premium versus the equivalent non-hybrid Pacifica. And while we're on the subject of money, here's how much this bad boy costs. Now, before recoiling with sticker shock, that price does include a range of automotive delights like keyless access with push-button start, ventilated front seats, a hands-free lift gate, power sliding doors, eight airbags, and an 8.4-inch Uconnect infotainment system with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. We also added a hybrid appearance package, because we've got to look fly, and an advanced safety tech package with front and rear parking sensors, a 360-degree camera system, an automatic parking system, full-speed adaptive cruise control, and collision warning with automatic emergency braking. With hefty batteries filling the underfloor storage area, the Pacifica Hybrid lacks the standard Pacifica suite stow-and-go seats. That seems like a workable sacrifice on the altar of efficiency, but who knows, after a year, these comparatively simple sliding seats might feel like a real burden. Oh, wait, no, that's not slide. Uh, yeah, that's how you slide them. We'll also learn whether the hybrid seven passenger capacity makes us long for the non-hybrid's eight person max. Either way, we've got a lot of fantastic electric adventures ahead of us. We've enjoyed the Chrysler Pacifica hybrid in the past, but as we all know, nothing reveals character and flaws like time. For example, you might enjoy me in short controlled bursts on the internet, but <laughs> try working with me for several years. <laughs>